Aviva's Power Suit Maker. Click on the button to choose your mode of play. Who do you want to build a creature power suit for? Pick a character. Aviva. Okay, let's get started. I'll tell you what we need, and you choose the correct body part and drag it onto the character. We need back legs that help move lots of earth while digging. That's right! Aardvark uses his hind legs to push loose soil backwards while he digs. We need arms with super strong sharp claws for digging. Nice work! The Aardvark can dig a burrow big enough to fit into in just 5 to 20 minutes. We need big ears to hear small prey and a long tongue to slurp them up. That's right! The Aardvark's 12-inch long tongue goes right into the termite tunnels. It's sticky, too! We need a good tail to lean on while digging. Nice work! The Aardvark leans on its tail to get more leverage while he digs through the concrete-like termite mounds. Let's take a look at this creature power suit in its natural habitat. Hit the go button! This is one of my favorite creature power suits ever. Do you remember what makes each body part special? Tap on them and you'll find out. Great job! Let's make a new power suit. We need short, thick legs with hairy feet and sharp toenails. That's right! The grizzly bears are big and heavy, but they can still run really fast. Their hind legs help them run almost as fast as a horse. This creature power suit needs super strong furry arms with huge paws and sharp claws. That's right! Grizzly bears have a large hump of powerful shoulder muscles, which help them tear through logs for food, catch prey, and sometimes fight other bears. We need a disc-shaped head with great senses of smell and hearing. That's right! Grizzly bears have a fantastic sense of smell and can sniff out dinner from miles away. This creature power suit doesn't need a big tail, just a short, furry one. That's right! A grizzly bear's fur is super thick and helps keep it warm and dry even in the coldest of habitats, like Alaska. Let's take a look at this creature power suit in its natural habitat. Hit the go button! Let's make some more creature power suits. This is fun! Great job! Let's make a new power suit. We need sharp, strong talons for grabbing slippery fish and other prey. That's right! Bald eagles use sharp talons to grab food like slippery fish, small rodents, and even other birds. All things you can find in Alaska. We need a scaly body that won't dry out in the desert. Again, we need a scaly body that won't dry out in the desert. Nice work! The Gila monster's tough scales keep water inside its body so it doesn't dry out. We need a head that has a good nose for sniffing out worms, insects, and berries. Oops! Try again! We need a head that has a good nose for sniffing out worms, insects, and berries. Nice work! A skunk is an omnivore. That means she's sniffing out both plants and animals to eat. This tail we're looking for is sleek and powerful for swimming fast through the water. 
Nice work! The gray white shark's tail is important in helping them motor through the water to catch sea lions and other prey. Let's take a look at this creature power suit in its natural habitat. Hit the go button! This is one of my favorite creature power suits ever! The gray white shark's tail is important in helping them motor through the water to catch sea lions and other prey. Let's make some more creature power suits. This is fun! Bald eagles use sharp talons to grab food like slippery fish, small rodents, and even other birds. All things you can find in Alaska. Great job! Let's make a new power suit. We need long, light legs for running fast. That's right! The cheetah's legs power him across the savanna at 72 miles per hour. We need a creature with huge lungs for breathing. That's right! The cheetah needs to take big breaths to get the oxygen it needs for sprinting. We need a head with special markings to cut down glare from the sun. That's right! The cheetah's black eye markings cut down the sun's glare so the cheetah can focus on its prey. We need a tail to help with balance during high-speed turns. Nice work! The cheetah uses its tail for balance during high-speed turns. Let's take a look at this creature power suit in its natural habitat. Hit the go button! How do I look? Let's make some more creature power suits. This is fun! Great job! Let's make a new power suit. We need back legs that help move lots of earth while digging. Nice work! The aardvark uses his hind legs to push loose soil backwards while he digs. We need arms with super strong sharp claws for digging. Nice work! The aardvark can dig a burrow big enough to fit into in just 5 to 20 minutes. We need a head with ears that can hear super high-pitched sounds that bounce back. That's not the one I was looking for. Try again. We need a head with ears that can hear super high-pitched sounds that bounce back. Nice work. Bats use echolocation to find their way around and locate prey in the dark. We need a thick tail that can store lots of energy. Oh, that's not the one I was looking for. Try again. We need a thick tail that can store lots of energy. That's right! The Gila monster's tail can store enough energy so it only has to eat three to four times a year. Wow! I'm really impressed with your creature power suit making skills. Excelente! You did it! Great job!